Welcome back, everybody. It is the end of April. It's almost May. We're going to do a 2020 Does It Still Work? All right. So we're going to do the five hidden chests first. So we're going to start out in White Run. Well, it's going to be a lot of fast forwarding through this. Why? I'm not Why this? teaching how they work. I'm just showing if they still do. Alright, so there's the white run chest. Still works. Let's go to the next one. Need to pick something up because I like to do the telekinesis glitch while I fast travel. Check. Dawnstar, check. Solitude check. Alright, so we're going to the last one, number five, Blue Palace. If you don't have a plate by now, get one. Platter, plate, doesn't matter. Yes, I could have just ran here, but it gives me extra alteration for fast traveling. 
Thane Bryling, at your service. Palace? Check. So there's all five of them. They still work. So all these timestamps are going to be in the bottom because I'm going to do pretty much every glitch. Um, so look down for in the descriptions below. Long life, lead the way. Still here. I will remain on guard here. All right, next one, duplication glitch. I need a bunch of oil spiders, so I'm going to do those. Disclaimer, different followers can duplicate different things. Most of them will generally do everything, but Lydia just happens to be my follower in right one, White Run. Fandal is my favorite because he seems to be the easiest, plus he's the first, but he's at Winstead Manor taking care of the place. So I'm going to use her because she's here. Certain magical items, certain quest items, well most quest items, and certain things like lunar steel, briar hearts, and a few other little ones will not duplicate. So it's a glitch. It's not going to work for everything. When you drop stuff, drop it one at a time. Don't drop a clump of four or five or six of them. Well, a clump is six or more. So don't drop, drop like 13 of them. You have to drop one. And then go and drop another one. I know it's painstaking, but that's the only way the glitch will work. If not, you're going to come back and your stuff's just going to be in your... In your followers inventory and that's it and you're gonna go it doesn't work you gotta drop them individually what do you need okay got it and some of you have asked before why I like oil spiders. Because they're basically homing napalm bombs. They leave a little trail of flame. And doing this glitch, when they explode, sometimes they'll explode three to four times. Some of them, they'll explode 15 to 20 times. It's a glitch. It just happens. Yeah, it's fun. So if you have the DLC, you can create your own spiders. I've made another video of how to do that and the ingredients for each of them. So again, drop them individually, don't drop them as a cluster.
What do you need? All right, here's well. I was gonna say here's the test, but I already see the spiders. So. What is it, Argonian? What you're doing that for? And there's my jewels. So does she have them? We heading out? How can I serve you, my thing? Certainly does. All right, duplication get glitch. Late April 2020 still works. I'm gonna do this a few more times because I need some more spiders, and then we'll go on to the next one. So here we are. We're going to do everybody's favorite. Fortify restoration. Just some notes. Like again, I'm not going to go through 100% of how to do this, but because I've made a whole bunch of other videos on doing it. But notes that you, you got to pound into your head. You need at least the first two of these. If you get three, four, five, even better. You need physician and you need benefactor. Anything else is just extra. So benefactor, physician, and one and two of five of this. For the point of this, I've already went to three. So it'll go a little bit faster. Disclaimer note. If you have already legendary this, it will add to your power. It'll make it go even a little bit faster. So if you have a little dragon underneath of there, you're going to get some speed boost. Things to note. You're going to want to get rid of every potion that you have. Every single one. Just store it somewhere. Okay. You're going to want ingredients for this. Long fins, spade tails, salt. Okay. Butterfly wings and snowberries are for the enchanting. Once you get your percentage high enough, then you make some enchanting potions. Okay. Problems people are having. They're hitting the plateau. These potions only last for 60 seconds. Now, when you go into your magic, you go into your active effects, and you look up for Fortify Restoration, which I don't have because I haven't drank one yet, that is your last potion that you've drank. So if you've drank 12 of them already, it's only going to show what your last one is. So your first one, you might have one second left on it. Your last one, you have 60 seconds on it. And then they're going to stagger in between then. Okay, if you can, get naked, except for, not in real life. Well, I mean, if you want to, go ahead, I don't care. But in the game, except for your four pieces. That way, it gives you a few extra seconds. Or, if you're making new pieces, put them all in order. So, or like, rename them. Like, all my stuff just alchemy, alchemy. So they're all right there. I don't have to scroll all the way down to find the ring and they're all the way back up for the necklace and it's just if you group them or get completely naked and only have those four things on it goes a little bit faster something else you can do it's called the leapfrog method so these are eight percent I think there's a five there's a five in here 
Um, if you can, if you feel like you can only get these up to a hundred or 180 or whatever, and you're hitting that plateau and you're starting to run low on ingredients, I call this the leapfrog. Make your fortify enchanting potions and then go find an arcane enchanter. If you do this at Dragon's Reach and White Run, there's an alchemy table and an enchanter literally right next to each other, like three feet apart. But make your enchanting potions when you're at your limit and make a new set of gear. That way, your armor or your necklace or whatever will be maybe you started at 8 well maybe now it's at 15 or 23 or something go get some more ingredients or use the duplication glitch and do it again so you're leapfrogging you're, you're taking a pause and going through save 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 all the time because what you don't want to happen is you're going really good all of a sudden you get to that point where they're making massive jumps. You you went from I don't know a thousand percent to thirty thousand percent. And then you try and do the enchanting part and you get the blue screen to death. Well now you gotta start all over again. Alright, we're gonna do this real quick. So, also, by dumping most of your ingredients, you won't have to go through all these. They'll already be lit up for you, so you won't have to scroll all the way to the bottom and go, oh, sh what's this, what's that? So, restoration. You only need two. Anything else is a waste. So, for whatever reason, I think because I've broken this game so much, and I've been doing this since... Yeah, I don't know. It's back since PlayStation 3. Um, it's, it's duping these for some reason, so I'll get two of them. Which I don't really want two of them. So, I'm just going to drop one, because it, it just gets confusing. So, drink it. Take your stuff off, put it back on. And now I'm just going to speed it up so you guys can see that it actually works. Alright, I'm going to stop here because I'm at the point where I'm going to blue screen to death. So there's six and the four. I'm at 12 million percent. And that probably took a minute or two. Now again, disclaimer, I have legendary this up. So I'm going to get an extra boost, which might be why my first potion doubled. But again, this is a glitch. Nothing is 100%. I mean, I remember when I first started doing this, I hated this because I was like, I don't get it. It's not working. This is BS. Why can everybody else do it but not me? Once you learn how to do it, it it's just like everything else. Practice. You, you get good at it. You get faster at it. Your fingers know where you're, where, what you want to hit. And bam, you can do it. Okay, so, but disclaimers. I've legendary this. I also have three of five. So mine's going to go faster. When I started out, three of the four pieces of um, gear that I'm wearing had 8% and one had 5%. Two is the lowest I've ever actually seen it, but the average is anywhere from, from 6 to 12. So anywhere in there, you can pick up some stuff. If you make something that's higher than 12, or if you buy or find something, like I've seen um, circlets that, that are like 22, 23%, do not disenchant that piece. Keep that, because that is ridiculous. If you can start out with 22 or 23, just just go for it. All right. So, let's see if I've talked for over a minute. Nope. I got six seconds left. 
So, other things that you might want to know that are going to probably irritate you a little bit. All right, is it six seconds over? It's over. So, I don't have any fortify restoration anymore. Out of all those potions that I drank, they're already all gone. It only counted the last one that I drank. So, I've already showed you how to leapfrog. Uh, let's see what else. So, yeah, I hope that uh, that helped clear a little thing, a few things up. You know, listen to my rambling and stuff. But it's the end of April in 2020. All these things still work. They've not been patched. So, good luck. Got any questions, comments, whatever? Drop me one and I'll respond to it as soon as I can. And don't forget to like and subscribe.